Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to Variety Pack Mission Mode. I'd just like to apologise about there not being an episode last Friday. The heat wave in the UK was just so hot to the point where my room was so hot that I couldn't record. It was either record it with a loud fan in the background, which would have ruined the video, or just wait. So I thought I'd wait. I did try recording it, so I kind of, I did I did 5-1, I didn't finish it, I just started it, but then I got too hot, so I didn't finish it, so I kind of know what 5 one's about, uh, so yeah, we just got passed through 29 rings on Rosalina's Starlight Coaster, but besides that, I didn't look at any of the mission, uh, the rest of the levels, so uh, let's get into this. Alright, here we are, I got a nice voice crack there, and um, yeah, I remember this mission being a bit of a pain uh, from when I played it last time, I didn't complete it, I was just too hot to, honestly, I, I didn't really, it was... It was like 30 degrees in this room, and that's definitely not recording environment. And because you don't really have air conditioning air conditioning here, I didn't want to do that. I'm doing much better than I did last time, though. But yeah, um, I remember there being like one massive design flaw with this track. You have to go like there and then round there, but it kept tricking me into going the wrong way and falling off and losing a load of time over it. So uh, hopefully we should be able to do all right if I can not hit the ring by accident like that. There we go, the next one, where is the next one? There it is, in the middle of the road. Got 30 seconds, we should hopefully be okay. I'll slam the brakes there, turn around. Right, let's go. Oh, doll. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, we keep hitting them. What am I doing? All right, we're going to restart. Yeah, I remember when I was trying to record this in when, it, when the heat wave was going on, it was a pain. And because I was hot, it was making me play even worse than I normally would. So um, it's definitely a good job I waited. And that was a very bad attempt. There we go. That's pretty decent, I think. Nice attempt there from that corner. Right now we've just got to slow down here. Boom, do that. Alright, now let's go up here. And not bump into any of them on the side this time. There we go. Much better attempt at that bit. We missed. <laughs> Alright, let's go. We're going to try and do it this time, hopefully. This is probably going to have failed us. <laughs> you know, no, this is definitely going to have failed us. And that's, yeah. I'm not going to lie, I'm not too keen on the gates on this mission. They're really badly placed, in my opinion. I don't know if it's supposed to be part of the challenge or, but I, I don't know. It's just something about this mission that I don't really like. <laughs> Alright, anyway, let's carry on with it. <laughs> Just got that one. <laughs> yeah, I keep bonking on them. I think they're too small as well. Apart from the one that's obviously on the star jump, that's absolutely huge. It's this bit here that always messes me up for whatever reason. Because it's so hard to actually see the gate because it blends in. And then I about run out of time, like, around here. Alright, come on. We're not going to be able to do it, I don't think, but... Might as well try. Where's the next gate, then? We've gone past the next... What? Alright. Damn it. <laughs> that makes me lose so much time just bonking once. Ruins the whole thing, I think. Yeah. 
my bunking there kind of helps actually because you're more likely to survive on the thing. Alright. Why is that there? I'm done with this mission. This mission makes no sense. Alright, I don't know what was going on with 5-1 there, but something was definitely wrong with it. It just didn't really flow or work well. The gates were placed badly and the time limit was a bit... Eh. But anyway, we'll, we'll ignore that mission. Uh, let's just go on to 5-2, which is pass through all nine rings on GBA's Bowser Castle 2. Alright, let's go. Alright. Hopefully, yeah, they're all spread out. This should be alright. If I drive well. There we go. Two. There, you can all see that you can see where they all are on the map as well, so you can kind of assume where they are. Which is a um, big benefit. <laughs> there we go, just do that like that. Don't want to go over the bump. Alright. Okay. Oh, the time limit's quite tight. I need to hurry up. Right, uh, I'll go with this one. Oh, close. One more. But we can do this. Bonked. Good start. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Alright, there we go. We're on two. I already out of nine. Get the third one. Bonked. There we go, right, okay, now we need to get that one. There's there. Oh, that nearly could have messed us up a lot. How do we survive that? How did we survive that? <laughs> Alright, uh, that was a bad attempt. I think the bonking really didn't help, so we'll start again. There we go, okay, four. We need to try and not like bonk anything this time. Because we don't want to slow down too much. There we go, that's six out of nine. Right, we should hopefully be alright. We this is this will be fine, this will be fine. There we go, let's head straight into nine. There we go, we have one second to go. That is five dash two complete. Definitely a much better gate mission than 5-1, because 5-1 was pretty awful. I actually enjoyed that mission, that was quite fun. So let's go on to 5-3. So 5-3, we've got to pass through all 23 rings on Night Factory, so it's another gate mission. 
All right, Night Factory. I like Night Factory. It's a really cool custom track, actually. Definitely one of my favourite custom tracks of all time. Just because it's... I, I don't know why. I kind of like the uh, alternative route on... Um, what's the track called? Whoa, where are the gates? Oh, there they are. <laughs> this, oh, it's like we're going around in circles. Uh, this is weird. Okay. But yeah, as I was saying, I really like Night Factory just because of like the style of it. How you go into... Uh, you get you're like in a reg track, but you go like a different route. I just think it's so cool. Alright, uh this is a very interesting mission. Um twenty two. Oh come on, come on, come on, come on! No, oh, we were right there. Damn it. Literally touching it. <laughs> That's really annoying. Right, we'll, we'll do it this time. I kinda like, know what the mission's about now. because uh, the gates were kind of a bit all over the place to begin with. Like, this bit here is a bit confusing. There we go, that one there. Boom. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Oh, we've got plenty of time. 23! Interesting mission. The gates were placed a bit weird at the start, but unique, I guess. So uh, let's go on to 5-4. Alright, 5-4. What have we got to do? We've got to collect all 15 coins on Maple Treeway. Alright, let's go. Alright. We've got Wigglers. It's going to be even harder with the Wigglers. Oh, they're in the... Okay, they're in the uh, Leafs. This will be interesting. Uh, so we're going to have to use the minimap a lot then to find where the coins are, so there's something here. Definitely one in there. <laughs> okay, uh, we've got a lot of time. We'll probably be fine. There's definitely one in here. Okay. One in there. One in there. One in there. Not one in there. One in there. Okay. Definitely one in there. Right, now we've got to get all the way over there quickly. And there we go, just in time with 0.4 seconds left. I, li I like that, that was pretty cool. I've never actually seen coins be placed under the uh, leafs before. I think that's awesome. So let's go on to 5-5. Alright, 5-5, what have we got to do? We've got to pass through all 37 rings on Snez Rainbow Road. Another gate mission. Alright, whoa, this looks like a very cool version of Snez Rainbow Road. I've never seen this before. This looks awesome. This track looks really cool. Whoa. I like this. Those swamps are cool as well, the texture of them. 8, 9, 10. Whoa. <laughs> we literally just jumped over the um, thing. Alright, we're going to do that. There we go. 13, 14. How many is there? 37. Damn. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, they can hurt you, apparently. That's nice. Alright, I don't know how, if we're going to have enough, enough time to get all of them. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, you know, I'm restarting. This Rainbow Road is so cool though, this, look at it, it just looks so cool. I really like this uh, version of it. Alright, let's not hit them. Right, there we go, 13, 14, 15... There we go, we're having a much better run this time, aren't we? 22, 23, 24, 25. Alright, we're going to do that a bit slowly, that part. Almost there. Two more. There we go, 37. That was a cool, that's such a cool version of this track. Those swamps look awesome as well. I like I like how they've got the Mario Super Mario Kart sprites as well around the uh, track. That looks really awesome. Uh, so let's go on to the next one. All right, five six. We have got to beat the clock in a time trial on Delfino Pier. Let's go. Okay, here we go. This is actually a competition from Nintendo WFC. Uh, I remember it. It was quite cool when I first played it, and now I'm playing it again. So 
That's uh, awesome. I really enjoyed this when it was originally a thing. Uh, I guess we got upstairs. I can't really remember what the route is, but I definitely remember playing it when I was um, younger. Back in the good old Nintendo WFC days. Alright, here we go. We go through here. Boom. Alright, now we've got last lap one complete. I really I really like it how um, they, there's so many of the uh, Nintendo WFC stuff. Because I think there was another one in a previous level. I can't remember which one it was. Oh, it was the uh, mushroom one um, on Peach Beach. That, that was, that's, one, that's literally my favourite competition of all time for some reason. Uh, I'm glad they brought it back into this mission mode pack. It's really cool. So anyway, let's go around here. Uh, up down here. And complete these four laps. This should be a pretty simple mission uh, if we don't mess it up. Uh, the time limit looks perfectly fine. So, um, yeah. I think it's cool how, uh, as well, that Nintendo used tracks like these for um, for their competitions as well. I just think it's really unique. Um, rather than using... Wait, can we go out that door? We can. I didn't realise that. <laughs> uh, so, I, I've been going like a really long way this whole time. <laughs> So, maybe we go that way next time, definitely. I did not know we could go that way. I'm an idiot. Alright, now we've got to be quick for the next lap. Um, so, we'll definitely be going that way. Because that could probably half the time, honestly. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to be quick. We're going to have to be very, very quick. I didn't know we could do that. <laughs> I really didn't know that. No, we've, we've, we've run out of time. <laughs> I did not know that you could go that way. Um... Let's retry that one. <laughs> right, now we can just do it the quick way, because I didn't realise that we could go through that door, because I don't remember that being open on the... Was it open in the competition on Nintendo UFC? I really don't know. But it's definitely open on this mission, so we'll be going... Oh, wait, it opens halfway through. Oh, okay, so I do have to go up here for a little bit. So I've just got to keep an eye on it. All right, that's fine then. Did not know that. Um, so we've just got to keep an eye on that, wait for it to open, I guess, because... It was definitely open towards the end of the mission, so maybe like after this lap, it'll be open. Uh, so maybe for the last two laps, you have to go that way instead of um, that way. Well, you have to go around there instead of going up, maybe. Oh, it's open now, so we'll, we'll, we'll do that next two laps then. Uh, Alright, let's go. I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't know if it was like that, honestly. <laughs> I wonder how many people like saw me like go past that because that definitely I definitely would have seen that at some point. But oh well, it's fine. We can just go the quick way now because the door has opened. Um, if I fail it on this attempt, we will um, just go through the door on the last three laps because I found out it opens on lap two at some point. But I think we're going to be all right because we've got 30 seconds left and I've still got just got to do a lap, which takes about 20 seconds if you go that way. Yeah, if that if this thing would go away, that would be pretty good though. Otherwise, I'm going to run out of time. So uh, yeah, we need to just go through here, through the pipes, around this door that magically opened on the other lap. All right now, avoid going in the water because it slows you down. All right, there we go. We complete it now. Um, <laughs> wish I saw that on the first attempt, but yeah, I really enjoyed that mission. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, five seven. Collect all 87 coins on DS Noco Noco Beach. Okay. Let's get these 87 coins, guys. Right, here we are on the beach. We've got to get these coins that go all around the track. Um, so, oh, you already missed one. You know, I'm going to restart. <laughs> okay. Let's try that again and hopefully not fail at this time. So, yeah, we still missed it because I'm an idiot, obviously. Um... Right, we'll just, we'll just carry on and just pretend that didn't happen, uh, I guess. We've got two and a half minutes anyway, so we should be alright. Uh, alright, you know what, I'm going to go this way and then come back for the other coins. I think missing them is going to cost a lot of time though, like this for example. That's probably cost me about five seconds, which is kind of annoying. So, uh, yeah, we don't want to be doing that too often. Get that one there, get these. You know, we might as well do the rest, we might as well just go this way, it'll be quicker to go backwards now, wouldn't it? Really, I think anyway, I'm not too sure, we'll try it. Um, here we go. Okay, get these. We've still got a minute and a half, we should hopefully be okay, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> um, Alright, get these, get these, get these.
Right, so I can come over here and get grab these ones like that. Yeah, I definitely have messed this up. Let's start again. Alright, we're gonna just go forward this time. And then um, we'll, we'll just we'll just do two laps, I guess. Collecting all these coins. Alright, here we go. Get these. Grab these coins on this side. And then we'll just go keep going straight on. And we'll come back for those ones towards the end of the uh, level. Or mission, should I say. Sorry. Oh, we'll, go, we'll go a long way first. Okay, grab that, grab that. It's really weird driving on water because it looks like you're going to just like fall out. Grab that one. That one looked like it was out of bounds for a second, actually. It's kind of scary, really. Alright, grab all these, grab all of these. There we go, got that one. Grab all these coins. Alright, there we go, we've done the first lap now. Um, right, now let's go around this way and collect these ones. Don't want to do a mini turbo because I just think it would be a bad idea. Alright, let's grab these. These ones, nice. That one looks like I should have got it on the last lap actually, thinking about it. But anyway, it's fine. I'll go this way now. You know what, I'll come back for that in a minute. Or is that going to be a decision I regret? Who knows? <laughs> we nearly got them all anyway now, so we should be alright. Honestly. Oh, we should be alright. We've got 40 seconds. Just go back and get those ones. Shouldn't be too bad. Alright, uh, I'll grab that one. Like that. That one like that. That one like that. We've just got that one over there. That we need to just go back around and get off the ramp. And we should be alright then. I've probably done this in the most like unorganised way. But whatever, it's fine. Because we've now got all of the coins. There we go. Easy. I actually quite enjoyed that. Um, going across the beach for all the coins. So let's go on to the final level. Well, final mission of level 5. Right, 5-8. It's probably going to be a boss battle. What boss battle will it be? Defeat the 6 spiky top men on Gal Galaxy Arena or Coliseum. Alright guys, let's go. Alright, here they are. And here is me. This was a uh, mission on Nintendo WFC competitions as well, actually. I remember playing this one as well. Really fun. Um, got six of them to defeat in 1 minute 20. So we've got to get some mushrooms as quick as we can. Here we go. Oh, damn. He, there was no messing around there. Okay, alright. What we need to do is we need to knock him off the edge. Off the map, like that. What? How did he not go off? Come on. Eh. Damn it, you know what? I'm going to restart this. Okay, here we go again. Here are the two spiky top men. Burning out. Okay, that happened. <laughs> that didn't go to plan. Got to hit six of these off as well, man. It's going to be hard. I forgot that this mission was quite hard when you've got a time limit. Because on the competition, uh, you definitely didn't have a time limit. Right, so I'll just do that again. Okay, let's grab this. I also forgot that I can't drift either, so that's great. Okay, get you out of this one. That's one. All right, I need to grab some shrooms immediately. Alright, that's going off, so that's good. Alright, get over there, mate. Alright, cool. Two more are coming in. Oh, if that went a few seconds earlier... That could have gone so much better, couldn't it? Nice, okay. The thing's moving again. We need to get them. Uh. Alright. I've got to get these two, and then we've pretty much won the mission. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on. I've just got to get these two off. It shouldn't be too hard because the area is a lot smaller now as well, so. OK, 
Okay, right, we need to... Oh, no, we've got seven seconds. Are we going to do it? Really don't think we are. No! We are so close. <laughs> Damn it. All right, we've got, to, we've, got to, we've got to try that again. We've got to get all six of them and not just five. All right, here we go again. We can try and win this, I guess. Uh... If, if we can actually get shrooms and knock them off like straight away, that'd be good. Not like that. That was a bad, bad thing. I just did that. All right, that's one off. Come on. Get off. There we go. All right. Another two. Come here. I know there's a strat that you, how you can get them off really easily, but I don't know how you do it, to be honest, really. Like, I know you can like you can reverse them and then like trick them into going near the edge, but I don't exactly know how you do it. Oh, it's like that. Let's go. Oh, that worked so well. <laughs> right, there we go. Two more. All right, get off. Okay, we need to try and I need to try and get I need to get a box, otherwise I'm screwed. Come on. Oh, come on. Can that thing just fall off a little bit earlier? No. Get off. There we go. We've won. Let's go. And that is level 5 of Mission Mode Complete. Uh, I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching. Again, apologies, I just couldn't record in that heatwave, so um, this will be coming out whenever I edit it. And uh, level 6 will be coming out on Friday as usual. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you all on Friday for the next video.